Right now, the youth, if they, first of all, only about 50% of them truly know anything about the Army. So that's a concern. Before I joined the Army, I thought that it would be very gung-ho, very, I'm a soldier, I'm going to run around and I'm going to carry a weapon all the time. You either go to college or you go to basic training or, you know, join the Army. Um, before I joined the military, I thought that everybody was either in infantry or an engineer, you know, combat type job. What has happened is the America, again, there's, there's a mess, so, you know, there's a variety of these myths that, that I could talk to, but I'll hit just a couple of you. There's a perception when you come into the Army, you know, it's just about a job. And so it's an either or, either you're going to come in the Army because you can't go to college or you can't get a job. Um, I'll tell you the vast majority of NCOs, and I know it's true, they may have come in, they may have just had a high school diploma, but I will tell you over time, they'll have an associate's, a bachelor's, a master's because of the emphasis on education. Another myth that is out there right now uh, is this whole notion that about two thirds of the youth actually think if they join the Army uh, that they may get hurt. I am not going to tell you that this is not a, a high risk profession, but the reality is only 10 to 15 percent of young men and women that actually are in contact, you know, direct or indirect fire, actually are subject to those type of uh, threats. So obviously we want to work to make sure that they truly know their army so they can make an informed decision on whether they stay or go. It, it's, it's our effort uh, to just make sure that the American public truly understands us. You get paid to train and you get paid to be in a career field that you would like to be in. As soon as I joined, it was completely different. Now I want to pursue an education more than ever, especially now they can pay for it. Now that I've been in, I noticed that it's not all about carrying a weapon. Uh, I carry a camera, and sometimes that can be even more powerful than uh, an M16.